In a time when bearded bastards were threatening to take over the earth, one man decided to take clean shaven to the extreme. Way too extreme. This winter, get ready to burn all your flannels. And chuck out your chaka boots. As Jay Sleazy combs through all the crap in your style. Hey man. Dude, do you want to go to log fest? Yeah, there's a music festival and a camping trip. This is gonna be dope. I like the music and all, but I'm just not into the whole homosexual looking lumberjack thing. Just a big sausage fest of dudes in the mountains, drinking IPA and squeezing maple syrup out of their wood. You might as well just call it Broke Jack Mountain. This time you've gone too fucking far, Q. You're the only one I could trust. First of all, what time is it? It's at least five o'clock. Last universe I was in. The average hair of Volco grows about 68 millionths of an inch every hour. If I'm gonna get down to the bottom of this, I've got to stay on top of it. Look at that. It says we're at peak beard. That no one with a beard is considered unique anymore. But why are they all following each other like a bunch of sheep? Well, ever since the Blackhawks won the Stanley Cup, an event known as Beard Zero. Beard activity has just been off the charts. We're past 100. Do you realize what that means? No. It means that even women are going to stop shaving. I think we're looking at a true beard Beardmageddon. I've got to stop this. Surrender your free will and trample each other in ticket lines to see Baldy vs. Beardos the movie. This movie is not yet rated because it sucks.